high. It's about 1149 on Sunday evening, and I've just felt the Lord prompting me to get online very briefly to let you know that I'm praying for everyone on this prayer page tonight. Uh, uh, I feel like people are going through some tough things right now. On Friday night, uh, there was an, a live prayer session and a lot of people were asking for protection for loved ones um, in the hospital, they have, battling COVID or countries where there weren't enough vaccines, those kinds of things. And then this morning, a good friend of mine passed away from COVID um, here in the United States. And uh, that's really been gripping me today. Uh, so if you would, let me just pray for you tonight. Uh, I want to pray for God's peace for you and to remind all of us what his word says. He never takes his eye off of us. He knows the very number of hairs on our heads. Um, he cares for us. Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Uh, dear Heavenly Father, uh, we uh, adore you and praise you uh, because we know the goodness that you bring to the world, that this is a dark place uh, in which we live. We've been th thrown in the, into this world in many ways and it can feel very overwhelming sometimes. Uh, Father, it's when we place our eyes on you that we feel peace and uh, our feet return to the ground. We feel that foundation of faith beneath us, and, uh, and, and we need that uh, tonight, Lord. We need the confidence uh, that you, and the reminder that you care for us, um, and we, we pray, Lord, that you would give us that measure of um, a sense of uh, your presence and awareness of your working around us, um, even though sometimes we feel an absence or sometimes we wonder, are you working quickly enough? Uh, we think you should move uh, faster. Uh, but Father, everything is done in your timing and your timing is perfect. Father, give us the confidence and peace that no matter what our feelings are, the truth is, is that you are in control of all things and you care for us very, very much. Father, be with those who are grieving this weekend uh, because someone they love is gone or someone they love is hospitalized or are they're about to step into a new work week and there are challenges ahead of them. Father, I pray that you will give us the strength and the security to know that you are already victorious and our job is to be faithful and to trust you even when we feel depleted in our energy and resources. Father, would you be with us and would you allow us to encourage one another in faith and in prayer so that we may build one another up to do those very good deeds and then to rejoice when... Um, we find release from these pressures and uh, the peace of God restores our strength and our joy in life. Uh, we pray this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen and good night. I pray you have a good evening, good rest, and an awesome week. Bye-bye.